YouTube, what's going on? This is Nate here. It is Thursday, September 29th, so we'll kick off Thursday Thoughts today by talking about the Kindle Fire, which Amazon just unveiled yesterday. This brand new 7-inch tablet will come in at only $200, and for the, most, uh, for the most part offers about the same functionality that the iPad does. But at $200, of course, it does have some limitations. The first is there's no 3G option, so it is limited to Wi-Fi only. It does not offer any cameras. It is only a 7-inch screen, so it is uh, smaller than the iPad, and it only offers um, up to 8 gigabytes of storage. But I think at $200, it offers a lot of great features, and it's great for anyone who wants to get a tablet for a cheap price. In case you didn't know, this week Apple sent out invitations for their upcoming event, which will take place on October 4th at 10 a.m. Pacific Time. At this event, Apple is expected to release the iPhone 4S or the iPhone 5, alongside of an announcement of when iOS 5 is going to be released to the public. Now this week we were also hearing some news about what might be happening at this event. We've heard that Facebook might be making an appearance demoing their iPad application, as well as announcing integration for Facebook and iOS 5. We already saw over the summer when Apple unveiled iOS 5 that Twitter would be integrated with it, but we didn't hear anything about Facebook. Now we're hearing that Facebook may be there as well. This week we saw some images of the iPhone 4S appearing in Apple's inventory. If you take a look at this product label here in the image, you will see in fact that it does say the iPhone 4S. And according to the label, it offers support for both CDMA and GSM, confirming the reports from Verizon earlier this year that the next generation iPhone would in fact be a global phone. We're also hearing this week that Apple may be uh, bringing price drops for the iPod Touch, making the 8GB version as low as $199, so we'll have to wait and see. So the iPhone 5, iPhone 4S, or both of those phones uh, being announced is coming very soon, and I'll be sure to keep you guys updated as we hear more and more info. So thanks for taking the time to watch this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.